Hey guys, this is Eskimo Poodle, and we're back to let's play Kingdom Hearts 2, Final Mix of Sonic PlayStation 4. Last time, we failed miserably at uh, fighting Vexen and Marilusha's datas. Uh, Marilusha, I just need to get better at it, and Vexen, it takes me too long to break his shield with my current strength stat. So I'm assuming once you get a few more levels and a few more strength uh, ups, and maybe a slightly stronger Keyblade or something like that, we'll be able to beat his uh, shield, because that's the main problem besides, you know, Shadow, Shadow Sora, or, or Data Sora, however they call it, being a bastard, but, uh, oh well. Uh, off screen, I also, well, I did, I did record it, but uh, then I deleted it because it was just 25 minutes of me failing. Uh, I tried to beat the next cup at the Coliseum, and I failed miserably, uh, because it's only you and, you, and you can only use summons, and I got really close, and then I died, but, uh, yeah. Uh, so we'll, we'll worry about that later. Again, just get ourselves a little stronger, and we'll be fine. Hopefully. Uh, let's see. We need to go do some... Let's see. You're done. You're done. We need Halloween Town, and then we can get back to Pride Rock. Eventually, we will actually make our way back to the Tron world as well, but I think you actually have to do Halloween Town or Pride Rock or something like that. Or maybe, maybe you have to do Pride Rock in order to actually get to it. But for now, let's do a Halloween Town. So, let's go. There's nothing wrong with my design. It's flawless! There must be something wrong with the parts those imbeciles brought me! I need to find better assistance. Gentlemen, lend me a hand, won't you? These presents must belong to Sandy Claus, so I thought I'd better return them. You just happened to find them? Of course, Sora. I'm finished with Christmas fantasies, you know that. I thought you'd hold on to the suit. What, this? It's just a costume. And Sally worked so very hard making it. Come on, we've got work to do. Yes, yeah, or it's a Halloween costume, so... There. Alright, uh, let's go ahead and... Auto our way over here. Okay, sure. Oh! Wherever did you find these? In Halloween Town. You'll be needing them for Christmas, right, Sandy? Of course. But these are just a few of the Christmas presents that were stolen. Stolen? Oh, Sandy, you don't think it was me? Still wearing the outfit, I see. I just thought I'd dress for the occasion. But if you don't believe me, then we'll just have to find out who really did it. Very well, I'll leave it to you. All right, Sora, Donald, Goofy, we're off! Oh well.
I feel like you should be able to change uh, Jack's outfit to either his Halloween version or his regular version. Is that just going to be the list that he checks? The mer oh, the merry-go-round. I thought that might have been his uh, Christmas list. Okay, that goes back outside. Well, we might as well see what's in here. Ruby's running behind enough as it is. The last thing we need is more trouble. This is true. More trouble is, uh, well, very troublesome. Uh, I think we got everything here the last time we were here, but I want to make sure there's not any... thing. Okay, doesn't look like there's anything that we missed. Neato. What is up here? I have no idea. I totally forgot. No! This looks good. No! Boring! This one? No! No way! Cow! So you three took them. Took what? You stole the presents, didn't you? It wasn't us. But... It really sounds like fun. Run for it! <laughs> Use the magic boxes to trap, lock, shock, and barrel. Okay. So I think for this, yeah, this is a boss fight, but then your finisher needs to be like, or maybe not your finisher, but towards the end, you need to kind of claw burn into the boxes with the reaction command. So, we'll see how this goes. Alright, so you're basically done, and that means you need to push out of you. Okay, cool. And I think they can actually break out of the... The, uh, the boxes if you're taking too long here. Also, it's a very hectic fight for some reason. At least it seems like it. Alright, yeah. yeah. okay, so we need to find another Christmas box here. You know, we need to actually aim at the person we're aiming at. Okay, so two are caught. We just need one more. No, yeah, one of them, one of them came back out. And I think that means... There we go. Actually, did they come back? No, they didn't come back out. Okay. I thought they came back out, but no, okay. I just didn't hit them with my previous, my previous attempt there. The fuck? Why are you not getting capped? I feel like I'm taking more damage from my teammates, but I don't think that's the case. Yeah, it was just a weird fight. Where'd you put the presents? We told you, we don't have them. Then why are you in here? We're looking for parts for the experiment. Experiment? Dr. Finkelstein's making us a friend. Why don't we get a boss around? It's true the doctor's been hard at work making something lately. Besides, Chris's presents are boring. Not scary or gross, so what good are they? Yeah. There's nothing fun here. Let's go back to Halloween Town. Makes sense that they wouldn't care for the easy stuff. So were those pranksters responsible for taking the gifts? It doesn't look like it. And that means... Sally! Oh, thank goodness, you're out here. Is something wrong? The Heartless are back. In, the Heartless are back in Town Square. I thought you should know. That's our cue. Back to Halloween Town. I think Donald's just tired of being a snowman. But wait. What about fighting the gift napper? Actually, the Heartless were playing with some presents when I saw them. Aha! We have our culprits. Why would the? Uh, why would they be hanging out with, uh, or not hanging out, stealing presents? I don't know. But, oh well. I don't know if there's anything else up in the boss room. Let's just check real fast, because why not? If it lists us in there. The wrapping. Neat. No, I guess there's nothing up here. Huh. You think there'd be, like, a, a chest or something? See, they could hide, a, they could hide like, a, sti a sticker or a puzzle piece up there, and that'd be a real pain in the ass to try to find or grab... Machine for making presents. Glad to hear it. Uh, what do you do? Makes presents, but is not currently running. Okay, these all make presents. I guess 
they only make presents during the boss fight. Fair enough. Alright, let's go back to Halloween Town where we can, you know, find the presents and get our own presents. Goodbye, Mr. Claus. You have a good day. Oh, hey, you guys are all over here. Ooh, Neo Shadow comes up. And I think I actually used my wrong item there. You guys. I think you guys drop stuff that I need at some point eventually for. for item creation. Pretty sure you do. Yeah. This is it. But we'll probably end up getting more of what we need out of them when we have, like, lucky, lucky on everybody. It's over. For now, we just kind of have to not get all the lucky, lucky, or the items from them. Come on down, there you go. Yeah, just like, just drive orbs. Yeah, it could be useful for Master Form, but at the same time, we'll have a, we'll have a really good way of doing Master Form soon, but... Not quite. Sadly, not quite. Eventually, though. You. Alright, there we go. Uh, yeah, still no items. Oh, there we go. Ether. That's not exactly what I was hoping for, but. Actually, no. That might have been, that might have been what I remembered them dropping as ethers. At some point, at some point, we're gonna look around for all the uh, people, all the stuff that we need to make uh, start making heavy on the synthesis stuff. But for now, we're mostly good without it. Gather. Goodbye. I wonder if we're gonna make us fight the boss in the same area that we fought the previous boss over where uh, the. The guy that was way up in the air all the time was. It seems like a solid enough place to, to fight. For sure, Nito. Those are useful enough. Uh, okay, nothing else back there we care about. You guys, are you guys, uh. Okay, you guys, you guys are not immune to physical attacks like the ones that you kept in remembrance. Fair enough. Uh, somebody is big over there. We, we oh, it's one of you guys. You just looked uh, very different when you were flying around in the middle of the air for some reason. Go away, fly. There's a tiny ass little fly that's directly in my path of sight here. And I'm not a fan of it. Donald, you are a chump, not a champ. Come on. Alright, uh... I think we just might have to go back to, like, Kimbo Science Lab in order to figure out where the present Napper is. Was there anything up here? Actually, I think there was a... I think there was a sticker, a uh, puzzle piece uh, over here somewhere that we could potentially get, but I'm not sure if we can get it, like, right now. Well, oh, fuck it, let's go. Master form in. I think with master form, uh, your gather just, like, or not your gather, your, uh, magnet does not last, like, very long at all. Come on, uh, I was, I was right next to it. Ah, no, oh, we almost had that. Yeah, like your magnet, like only lasts like a second or two in master form for some reason. Come on, I want you guys to come over here. I can you know, grab the sticker or not, you bastards. You guys all suck. Yeah, I think we still need a couple more abilities to grab that, uh, puzzle piece over there, sadly. Lucid Stone. Nito. That is helpful. Yeah, I think we need a little more. 
Well, yeah, I think when we get the uh, final ability from our final form in the game that we're going to grab, I think that, then we can get it. Because even right now, with a, a good high jump and double jump level, we're just not going to be able to make quite over the yet. Granted, I think my high jump is not very, or my double jump is not very high, so, oh well. Yeah, we'll get it up there eventually. Keyword there being eventually. I don't think there's anything else in this little area. I mean, it wasn't bad for screaming stuff. Uh, okay, yeah, we're good over here then. Okay, you guys... We don't always need to fight you, but if you're there, why not? Uh, actually, I don't remember if the Neo Shadow is dropping anything good in this game or not. I remember they were reasonably decent for... You! You can't be here! Leave Halloween Town by order of the mayor! Somebody! Anybody! I'm only an elected official! I can't handle this by myself! Sally was right! We've got to get the presents! I'm pretty sure that's his catchphrase. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we had to fight the, uh... This is it. I'm pretty sure we had to fight the Neo Shadows for the yeah. ultimate weapon or something like that in Kingdom Hearts 1. Granted, they didn't exist in Kingdom Hearts 1, the base game, so they just, they just added them, uh, changed the recipe, and finally executed them. So. Alright, you guys need to all calm down here. Oh, I guess, I guess our presence that we had got knocked out of it somehow, which is kind of shame. Kind of weird. Okay. Oh, I think this guy just managed to get him for some reason. I'm granted he is like a giant treasure box, so, you know, that kind of helps his cause. Fair enough. What a shame! It looks like it was such a nice present. Uh, Jack. Oh, help! Someone help me! My latest experiment is gone! It's been stolen! Presents. I was just sitting here brainstorming while all of a sudden I was attacked. I collapsed, and when I woke, my experiment was gone. Don't worry, Doctor. We know who took it. Ooh. The Heartless. What? Those wretched things? Preposterous. This was nothing like a Heartless. Not the Heartless, huh? Who else could it be? Say, I have an idea. The thief must like Christmas presents, so we place, ir we place irresistible gifts about to draw him into about to draw him into a trap. And this miscreant is the same one who stole my experiment. That's right. How will we know for sure? Well, now that's easy. We'll scare a confession right out of him. Gosh. What do you say we go with Jack's plan? Just for now. Let's get to Sandy's house post haste. We've got to make some Christmas presents quickly. Have you found the presents yet? Almost, Mr. Claus. We're going to we're going to reel in the thief with Christmas presents as bait. Would you mind if we used your factory to create a few presents? Presents as bait. Goodness, I don't like the sound of that. Just this once, I suppose. If it's it's for a good cause. Alright, use the second floor and put some heart in it. Oh, do we actually have to, like, go up there and make presents? Because that'd be kind of odd. Like, maybe it's like... It could be a mini game. Could not be. It could just, you know, be story stuff. Who knows? You're going to make presents, right? You can use this machine. Uh, sure. Let's do it. 
Use the cannon to shoot toys in the empty boxes. Press triangle to reload the cannon with toys. It takes a few seconds to reload, so try to be accurate. Watch out for lock, shock, and barrel. If they try to stop you, launch a toy at them. Okay. So, let's see. There's a toy. Toy. How many do we... How many... I guess... Okay, appara apparently it's not as, uh... Not as, uh... Apparently... Okay, we have 30 shots. I, I was like... Okay, it seems like we don't have to worry about it too much, but okay. Come on, just shoot some presents over here. Kill a little bastard. Thought oh, you were fucked. Go away. I don't know why these fucks insist on bothering us. But, I mean, don't they have anything better to do with their, their days? I don't think they do, actually. So this is not terribly difficult. Okay, that was pretty easy. Not quite. There's more? Don't worry, I'll take care of the rest. Decoy presents. Yep. Did you finish making the presents? Yep, just waiting for Jack. So, uh, where do you think we ought to leave them? Hmm. Oh, I know a good spot. Whenever you're ready, just say the word. I'm back. Yeah, for some reason I was thinking there was like a longer time in between shooting the presents out, but there was not. So, that works. Oh, somebody got a new ability. Oh, Goofy. Uh, you got... Ooh, auto change. Yeah, I don't really care about that. Okay, fair enough. And we also got... Presents, gems... Other stuff we don't care about. Okay. We're ready, Santa Claus. Now then, are you all set? Let's go. This puzzle should work well for your plan. Now, Jack, what is your plan? I've got it all figured out. You do? Of course! And I also have a wonderful idea. If we catch the thief for you, I would be honored to deliver the crew. And present. on that note, hey! we'll be going. What are you doing? Let me go! Stop picking! It's not me, Donald. Patience, friends. Gorge, was that you? How come we have to be the bait? Good plan, eh? Ouch! Dr. Finkelstein's experiment did it! I think we can see a lock up Dr. Finkelstein, because that guy is always causing problems somehow or other. Like, he, whether he needs to or not, he's just somehow always going to cause problems here. But, this guy should not cause too many problems himself. Not anymore, anyways. We should be okay. Uh, this is... I'm not entirely sure if those little bastards actually do a whole lot, but they're there. The little uh, arms that he shoots off, but let's go ahead and master form up. We're not going to get any experience out of it, especially since we're in anti-form, like the little bastards that we are. And we can't use reaction commands, that's great. Come on, just kill the thing. I get the concept, I, I get why Anti-Form exists, you know, it, it's a callback to when Sora turned into a Heartless in the first game, plus it's a good way to make sure you don't use your forms, but at the same time, it's real fucking annoying when you're just trying to get through something like this, and that pops up for 
no real good reason. Oh well. Let's not uh, do your little laser beam there. There. Let's go ahead and high close on ourselves. And your waste of mana. Get up. Next spring. Let's see if that did anything. I don't know if it did. I don't know if the kick screen. I don't know if that kick screen actually did anything. Besides potentially uh, get us out of the line of fire from his little laser beam. Yeah, this guy not gonna cause any problems there. There we go. More HP. Jackpot for health and stuff. We need Lucky Lucky, not Jackpot, Donald. But oh. The mystery is solved! Did you catch the thief? Naturally. I just can't figure out why the doctor's experiment would go around stealing Christmas presents. His experiment? The thief. It was a moving puppet made by Dr. Finkelstein. Hmm. The doctor has made a moving puppet. I see. He is always tinkering with things. Now listen, Jack. I'd like to thank you, and while delivering presents is something only I can do, I can give you an idea of what it's like. Sandy Claus? Yes, all that poor puppet wanted was a heart. Ho, ho, ho! Decisive Pumpkin, one of the best physical keyblades in the game. The greater number of combos landed, the more damage is dealt, leading to a strong finishing move. But yeah, this is a really good, uh. Interesting. Keyblade. So the puppet wasn't stolen after all. It ran away on its own. In other words, my experiment was an overwhelming success. Santa Claus thinks maybe it left because it was trying to find a heart. That's quite possible. Unlike my Sally, it wasn't equipped with a heart. But if it wanted a heart, why was it going around stealing all those Christmas presents? Maybe because presents are a way to give your heart to someone special. Hmm. When you put it that way, I feel sort of bad for it. Happy Halloween! What a nice present. I don't understand. There's no box. No ribbon tied in a bow. Jack, it's not about the box or the ribbons. It's about what's inside the box. No, Sora. What really counts, what's really special, is the act of giving the gift to wish deep in your heart to make someone else happy. Right. Of course. Thank you, Sally. You're absolutely right. Wait. What's this? I feel so strange. So very happy. Jack, that must be Sally's present. Really? This wonderful feeling? Oh, Sally. You've given me the nicest present in the world. And I've nothing to give you in return. What would you like? Just name it. Absolutely anything. The nicest present I could ever ask for, Jack, is just to be with you. You don't even have to ask for that. Oh! <laughs> Maybe I never gave her a real present after all. 
Oh, I bet Kyrie would like most anything you gave her. I know. That's what made it so hard to decide. It's not the gift, it's what's in your heart. My heart? You bet. Tom is that side How? Well, as long as she can be with you, what else does she need? <laughs> That's right, I guess Sora doesn't know that uh, Kyrie is growing up. Which, by the way, I never really thought about it before. You're getting, you're getting bigger, huh? What's that? That big thing! Maybe that's the source of the weird reading we picked up before. And there's something funny about Twilight Town. I'm seeing two of them. Two? Look, it's another huge energy reading, and it's coming from some place near the town. But it sure looks like there's some big trouble brewing around Twilight Town. Yeah, that means we can finally get back to like uh, the area where we did like the uh, Seven Wonders and whatnot. Do we actually go over to this yet, or do we still have to? Let me see. We'll try to li Looks like a no go. Okay, I was about to say. Gorge, maybe the gate got stuck or something. Uh, without spoiling too much, uh, if you go to Twilight Town, I think you'll eventually, uh, it, it'll, oh damn, we actually have to do another gummy mission to get over this. But yeah, if you, when you go to Twilight Town, it'll unlock the, the way into the world that never was over here. So, yeah, it's pretty neat. But yeah, uh, Sora doesn't realize that Kyrie's all grown up now. And also, I never really thought about it, but... It's only been a year since Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2, and damn, Kyrie got a massive growth spurt slash just change in general. Like, yeah, Sora grew up a little bit when he was stuck in the, the pod, but, like, that one year of puberty real did, did real wonders for Kyrie. Like, he was entirely different, pretty much. Alright, let's go Master Form. Yeah. Try to actually get some of uh, yeah, try to get some stuff out of this. And then I wanted to just see if there's anything where the boss was. There might be. We'll find out. Uh, give me your orbs. You have got it. Uh, you, you hurt, you know that? Come on, give me some of the good stuff. Okay. Uh, with some orbs. There we go. We got our air combo plus for Sora. That's nice. That's actually real nice. I really wish that more of the forms, like Master and then the next one we're going to get, had the, uh... Ooh, you really hurt, you know that? Had the, uh... The ability to finish their combos with Square like the Form does. It's just a real nice ability that I really miss in other forms. Then again, the, uh... The ability to actually use magic in another form works out pretty well, so that's, uh, that's nice. Okay, you stop with your bullshit. Okay, you're still dying up there. That's fine. Uh, there you go. Got him. More ethers, that's great. I want to see if anything pops up over here. Like, more puzzle pieces or treasures. Oh, it's a, it's a Mushroom 13. Uh, let's see. Begin the duel. Avoid the enemy's magic spells. We could try it, but eventually I'm just going to do all the Mushroom 13 in, in, like, an episode or two or three. So, we got to avoid your spells, huh? Okay. 
I don't know if we actually have to attack the guy or not. I think we just have to avoid the spells, and I don't think I did very good there. I think, yeah, I think Reflect might actually work out pretty good here, so let's just do that. Come on, give me up. You hurt, you know that. Well, we... Okay, apparently we failed miserably at that one, but, uh... 53, how many do you have to avoid? Because I thought, you know, well, I didn't thought. I don't know, I don't know how many are supposed to avoid, but I feel like 53 was pretty good, in my opinion. So. It was good enough for me, at least. Yeah, let's see if we can uh, get him to respawn, because I think those Mushroom 13 actually do respawn reasonably quick-like. So... Let's try that again, shall we? I'm not going to spend forever on this, but I will, you know, attempt again real fast. Let's see. Especially now that I know we can just, you know, reflect on the dude. That hurt. Sometimes he gets mad and does the one like real fast. Okay, that hurt. Or it didn't hurt, but uh Yeah, sometimes he does a whole bunch at once. They're they're not even doing any damage, they're just uh Sometimes they come out fast. Okay. Let's try that again. Okay, I think I think for that one I did it too early, and apparently I got hit too many times. Huh. Let's try one more time just to see if we can uh, do it. But apparently there's a trick that I'm missing. So, but again, we'll worry about these guys for the most part uh, later. By the way, before I forget, yeah, let's put on our decisive pumpkin, which has pretty good strength. Not much in the way of magic, but yeah, it's got a. One of the higher strength stats of the game, and the uh, combo boost finisher, or the combo finisher boost, so that works out pretty damn well for the most part. It really does. So that'll be useful just in general. Frankly, I think I prefer the design of the the pumpkin head from Kingdom Hearts 1, because this is just uh, the, like, well, I think that guy was in, like, the, the movie, like, the guy that was like, eating all the Christmas presents when they went to the houses and stuff. So yeah, I think I just prefer the, the basic black design of the Kingdom Hearts 1 Keyblade, but this one is good for stats. So there you go. All right, let's go ahead and... Okay, you are being cheap. There you go. There you go. That worked. Ooh, there we go. That was nice. Alright, we have to wait for our MP to come back. Okay, well, we got something out of it. Let's see, we got tents, tranquility stones, drive recoveries. Ooh, joyous mushrooms. That's actually a shield for uh, Goofy. Uh, it's one of the uh, the weaker shields that you can get out of the mushrooms. But, yeah, uh, for Donald and Goofy, you get various new uh, staffs and shields that weren't in the original version of the game. And they're all pretty good. At least the higher tier of each one of them is really good. We got, oh yeah, your combo plus, that's right. Uh, that's nice, but uh, let's see. I don't know what else did you get. You got, oh yeah, you got a jackpot. But, 
for Goofy, they're pretty good for the fact that, let's see, Ogre Shield you have Defender, which is nice. But the Joyous Mushrooms, this one, okay, apparently this one's not that great. But the uh, the other two that you can get from them are, are pretty good. I thought this one had something, I thought that one had something else on it, but I guess not. Oh, well. Yeah, the point is, you can get some cool stuff out of them right there. And I think if you... I think if you manage to do their little game perfectly, then you get a uh, much higher drop chance off of it. I want to see if we can do that one more time and uh, see how we do. Again, it's not necessary, and we'll probably be doing all these guys at some point anyways. I think you have to get, like, the best score possible on them in order to get their uh, best uh, item out of them. But... Either way, you get some good stuff out of it. Son of a bastard. There you go. Oh, so did, I went with you earlier. Okay, that worked. Yeah. Nice. Okay, well we got some other stuff there. Yeah, I think I think uh, some of the some of like his faster ones are kind of a pain in the ass to avoid, but oh well. Either way. We finished up with the Halloween Town. Next episode, we're going to go back to Pride Rock and see if we can't deal with whatever is going to happen over there. So, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good one.